Hey, it's your boy Surge Dragon, and welcome back to another edition of Bra uh, Bleach Brave Souls. Like I said, I was going to do the White Day event, and let me first say that we got some news. Besides this, I might try a hand at that. This was already announced, the White Day special. There we go. I was hoping they weren't erased yet. New Resurrection characters. I already got the... Uh, guy in the middle. Damn, I forgot his name again. Uh, might as well check. Check on him. See, I got him right here. So I can get him to resurrection six stars. Kisuke. 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 Okay. But also, let's check out the characters. I'm going to do these guys in my next video because I got to do the... Well, actually, no. I got to do theirs first. So let's go ahead and see them. That's right. I got more uh, time. Let's go ahead and screenshot this. White Ichigo, Arankar, the Overlord Summon. The Overlord summons his fortress, releasing terrible energy that causes immense damage and inflicts weakness. Oh, boy. Let's see what he can do. He's a light element, which is weird. He should have been a darkness. Why is he a light? This makes no sense. Let me see how good he is, though. Damn, it's taking a long time to load. Okay, here we go. Okay. He's a range. Okay, let's see this special. So that's the fortress, huh? Not bad. I was able to get it the last second. I saw it hit zero zero zero, and I was like, "Oh, so I missed it." Nope, oh, <laughs> I did not. <laughs> That's right. So the White Day event special will last a couple of more days, but the one for the Choco Society here will last uh, less. So I'm gonna do that one first. Okay, now we gotta see this one. Gein. Oh, what was it titled? Only those who have seen the view from the summit can understand it okay this is just my feeling will you accept it oh okay white days oh he's an earth attribute okay let's see you're a ron car what the hell i thought you were i guess not a minimum memory i can't it's not a nimble slashing attack that causes immense damage and inflicts poison oh shoot melee Okay, that's again another one. So nine a go sent to it, chant to modo de crute. You be confused as a hint. Jamaya. You so nine a go sent to it, chant to modo de crute. You be confused as a hint. Jamaya. Oh, my young. Miss me. Okay, now that I think about it, they have Ging. 
how is it they don't have they don't have uh, Rangiku in the Coco Society? I'm trying to think here, and the uh, other specials here, because they got Nanao, and Nanao has her own s Valentine special. They don't got Rukia. I'm trying to think of other characters. I know Rangiku and uh, Yo Chik, uh, you know the little pink-haired girl that hangs out with Kampachi. I'm bad with names. They all had their first uh, Valentine special, and here's Byakuya. Okay, this is the first time I have drawn a sword for a cause, and I swear it will be the last. Okay. No, 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 no! I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do this. There you go. And he's a water element. Cool, cause he's got blue rose. That's that's fitting. Okay, screenshot that. It's funny. Blue rose are not grown naturally. They're made chemically. Okay. Blade of Honor, an elegant sword technique that causes immense damage and causes par paralysis. Soul Reaper, hell yeah. Alright. Oh, he causes paralysis all around. Whoa. Get in the middle. Oh, he is everywhere! Got him. With the way his uh, special attack, I thought it would just be a thrust and he leans forward or something. Nope, he attacks everywhere. That's what they've been doing of late. Okay, and I gotta show this one. I gotta show this one just for the sake of argument. This one I'm gonna try and get. I wanna get her so bad. Uh, I like Yoichi. She's one of my favorite characters in Bleach. Just for her, her character, sex appeal, her raw power and technique all around. She's good. Plus, this is cool. Watch this. She's go feral, causing immense damage like this, just standing, and all her attacks are recharged. The fact that this is only seen in the manga, to see it animated is just amazing. They did they did not disappoint on that. Because Kisuke was the one who injected her with that. This is the second time that's happened in her life in the storyline. Ah, oh, I want to do that, sir. Okay, but first, I got to do these guys. I got enough of these orbs, thanks to the events and the co-ops. So I'm going to go ahead and see who I get. I'm probably not going to get anybody from the Coco Society, but I'm going to try. Uh, ooh, we got one. We got a five star. Hell yeah, I got Stark! I don't think I got Stark on that one yet. Yeah, I don't. I got one. Okay, Rose. It was his birthday a while ago. Earlier this week. And I think this is the last one. Nope. That was the last one. 
All right. Put in a good four stars, but I want to go ahead and go under more for this one. I don't remember his character, so I definitely would like to use him in a couple of battles. This is my second Coco Society character, so this is good. Lock him, so I don't accidentally use him for that. Uh, oh, it looks like he's melee, despite having the guns. Nope, he has a melee. I mean, a range. He has a range. Okay. So, uh, let's see. Summer's coming up, so I definitely might want to save it. But for this one, I'll make an exception. So I can still summon, uh, I think, maybe f two times. Yeah, two times. Because 500 is two times, and I'll still have, like, 600 or something. Yep, I was right. So I'm going to do this. And, whoa, 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 whoa. Just for arguing sake, I'm going to have to like that. See if that gives me any luck. Here's hoping. If it turns yellow, I'm going to be... Uh, oh, no, I got a five star. Let's see what I get. Oh, I got this one. He was one of the three. He's an earth element. Wait, what? Oh, I don't have that one then. Here's Rangiku. Here's no... Uh, I forgot his name. Number five. Retsu. Gin. Uh, Spada one with the fire. And his name was right there. I wasn't about to spell it. There's Renji. Siphon. Uryu. Okay. So, I definitely want... He's new. I, def I definitely want him. A lot of the times, Ichigos are good in this game. Bet on that. So, this is the... I got... Three H different Ichigos now that are five stars. Okay. So that's all I'm going to spend. I tried my luck, and I want to save it for the summer event, because I have no idea what they're going to have. It's barely going to be spring. I think today we marked the beginning of spring. So give or take, I'm going to save up, see if I can get 2,000, and I'll be spending like crazy on the summer characters, just so I can see if I can get some of my favorites. And hopefully I can get another chance at this come the anniversary. It's a water element. And there's another water, a couple of water elements I definitely need. So hopefully she'll be in the list. And I might come across her later on. I don't know. In the meantime, let's do this storyline. Uh, how far are we in? 13 minutes? Okay, let's go ahead. There we go. See, four days left. There we got to do it. And we got the Chaz event in the back. All right. Okay. The Arrival. Oh, and he's back there, too. The bookmark guy. All right. I'll be right back with the storyline. I think here we go. Come on. One more after this, I'm guessing, because it's taking a sweet time. And, yeah. There it goes. Okay. Previously on Coco Society. The night before Valentine's Day, Ichigo wanders into another world called the Coco Society, where he finds himself in the midst of a battle for sacred treasure, which is usually some sort of tofu or something. And he wakes up from the dream. Oh, it's not even him. It's always somebody else. It's always somebody else. It was the fox dude. It was the... Uh, lieutenant of the he uh, four, squ four squad with the white hair, you know, the tall girl, <laughs> uh, you know, and so on and so forth. So forth. There was a Halloween. There was a Aladdin, and here's another one. So the matter was eventually resolved, and Ichigo returned to his original world. However, the Coco Society is facing yet another threat. In order to overcome this new predicament. Ichigo travels to the Coco Society once again. So this is no longer a dream. The Coco Society is literally another universe altogether. And here we go. Why Ichigo? Uh, let me see if I can do a sinister voice. That's high pitch. <clears throat> They're here.
We've arrived. Welcome to Takoka Society. That was not welcoming at all. What the hell was that a device? Are you telling me I have to go back with that too? No, don't worry. I'll be able to properly send you back with magic for your return trip. It should be a little more comfortable than this. That was a mis makeshift device I made on the spot, so it seems we've landed slightly off target from our destination. Let's head to the castle as soon as possible. So he's a little craftsman in that world too. Oh, that's good to know. I'll be right back. There go. And there she is. You know, just walking through this forest doesn't really make me feel like I'm in another world. You think so? When I went over to your world, it felt like I was in a whole new world. Well, yeah, I bet. I'm surprised you actually thought to come over. I was curious, after all. Oh, he said it like this. I'm, I was curious, after all. Not to mention, the situation is pretty dire. Yeah, about that. What is this threat you... Got caught off. What? Orders from the Overlord? Don't lie to me. Fine, all right? Ugh. Seriously, I can't believe this. Ow, what the hell? Huh? Is someone there? Hey, you just... <laughs> That's right, no matter what universe, Ryuka has a crush on Ishigo. She likes how he looks. <laughs> it's kind of funny, I like to see that. <laughs> With Orihime and everything. Uh... What is it? it? It's nothing. Don't come any closer to me. What the hell is that supposed to mean? You hit me with the that rock. You should apologize to me first. Looks like you belong to the Overlord's forces. Sorry to trouble you, but would you mind coming with us? Yeah, right. In your dreams. You're one of Coco's castle's knights. I take it. My name is... Ryuka Doko Ga Mini. Or is it Doko Mine? No, Doko uh, Mini. Doku Ga Mini. Best I said it. And there's no way I'm going to be defeated here by you guys. As you can see, I had the white Ichigo as assist. Somebody was lucky enough to get him. To be quite honest, I prefer that you don't make me hurt you any further. <laughs> hey, damn you! Wait! Damn, somebody's violating my phone. Looks like she got away. Tell me, do you know anything... No... Wait, what? Do you know about this overlord guy she was talking about? Yeah, they said it wrong. I think it would have been better if you said, do you know anything about this overlord guy she was talking about? That would have made more sense. I can explain, but it's a long story. Let's make our way back to the castle first. Okay. Let's see how many chapters are in this one. The shocking truth. I'll be right back. Here we go. Ich oh, yeah, he says like this. Ichigo! Man, I missed you so much. Kago? Wait, why are you here? Ah, so you weren't aware. Remember when you and Uryu came to this world? He also arrived at the same time. What? Sorry, my voice was a little off. He's, he's like, what? Like that. He's been living here at the castle ever since. Well, I bet you, you're glad someone's finally come to take you home. Dude, you finally are flat out mean. You guys are flat out mean. How could you just leave me behind? Day after day, I've been ho 
helping out with picking medicinal herbs, organizing the library, and baking cookies together and chatting over tea. Sounds like you've been enjoying yourself, actually. Ah, Holly Bill. That's one of the characters I want, and I like Holly Bill, too. Do you mind chatting up with each other at a later time? First, I must apologize to you for having to request your aid once again. Oh, it's no problem. If Keiko's been here the whole time, I would have had to come back and get him eventually. It's not like I can just take him home now, right? I heard you in trouble. So you can please tell me what's going on. So can you please tell me what's going on? <laughs> Read right back. There you go. Got him. Always check. Damn. Hate those loud ass freaking sounds. So, to sum this all up, you need to defeat this overlord, is that right? Yes, but the overlord is strong. We fought against him once before, and we were no match. Ever since our last battle, the overlord has continued his attack on us without ever leaving his fortress. In order to enter that fortress, you need to use a certain magical device. Unfortunately, the one we, we obtained was destroyed. So our plan to find another enemy soldier and take their device. So our plan is to... Yeah. We've been launching attacks on the fortress as a diversion, but we simply lack enough fighting power to make any advances. If other... If only the divi uh, diversion could lure out the Overlord, that would make our lives easier. Either way, we still need more help. That brings us to our next topic. We're going to request the aid of our allies, Ichigo. I want you to come with me. Alright. <laughs> I need to check something. Okay, next chapter is the Overlord's Fortress. Let me see. Um, truth be told, I know I'm gonna have to. I hate to do this, but I might. Let me see. What's the highest level you can go? Oh, I could have saw it right there. Uh, oh, a hundred. Okay, so just get these get out to him. Okay, give you all these characters because I'm not going to use them. I can't upgrade them. I uh, think I'm done using all of them, but I'll check before I do that. You can go to... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. So, 105. Okay. I'll be right back with the next. There you go. Had to do a couple of things, and I'm back. The Overlord's Fortress. What the hell? That guy. <laughs> it's no different. <laughs> She's. She thinks he's dreamy. He's good looking. Uh, never mind, better words. He was so hot! But why did he... Yeah, they introduced Gein, this version at least. You seem to be having fun. Are you entertaining with your facial expressions? Are you experimenting with your uh, facial expressions? It's none of your business. Why did you call me back all of a sudden anyway? You two never come back, and the fortress was under attack. I was just worried that something might have happened, that's all. She sided with them, is if that's what you're asking. And she used me as bait. I can't believe her. She's talking about Soyphone. 
<laughs> I just remember that. That was so funny. <laughs> they read the, the anime the, from the freaking Soul Society. I love that. With Soyphone and Yoruichi. That was just perfect. <laughs> Making Soyphone look so cute. Anyway, Gein says, Oh, is that right? It sounds like we've got a little problem. What should we do about it, Overlord, sir? Okay, here comes the crazy. Nothing. It doesn't matter to me who does what. I'm nothing interested in any of it. I'm not interested in any of it, as he says. Okay. Uh -huh. It's probably not my place to say this. I may say anything about your lack of care for things, but I wish you were slightly more interested in our interior decor. What are you trying to say? You got a problem with my... Re... No... What? What the... Re... No... Renovations I did for this place? Don't usually see that word. I'm not complaining. It's just a bit too... Gordy for my taste. This fortress isn't even gordier if you ask me. This fortress itself is even gordier if you ask me. You're so stupid. I'm going to eat some donuts in my own room. Bye. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I almost forgot. I figured you want to see this map. Okay, let's see. We got these. Big ass donuts. We got the strawberries. We got these guys in the way. We got the presents. We got the macaroons, the donuts, the cupcakes. I think that's a no. That's a giraffe. The weird looking plushies that Rukia likes too. Oh, perfect. Okay, storyline time. I know. No need to point it out. Oh, that she did work with this guy. Okay, whose name is Sekusami? Sekusami. Sikisumi. Sikisumi. Sekisumi. Kisume. Kisume. Eh, eh, eh. Nari? Eh, eh. Sikisumi. I keep saying it. Back. Forget it. Forget his name. Siki. I'm going to call him Siki. Suki. That. Shime. Shime. I'm just going to call him Shime. Okay. Hello, Ryuka. It's been a while. Shime, why are you here? How did you get in there here? I thought it was impossible for anyone else to come in. I don't know. Well, I am a mage. Getting here wasn't that difficult of a task. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing? Intruders are enemies, and we eliminate enemies. That's the proper thing to do, isn't it? I didn't come here to fight. You think I really believe such an excuse? Don't interrupt our conversation. I'm fired, you're grass. You do the math. You helped me. You're so nice, Ryuka. Shut up! I just wanted to finish talking to you. It's not like I wanted to help you, okay? So, why are you here? There's something we want you to help us with in order to make our wish come true. Ryuka, you met him, didn't you? The man who looked very similar to the Overlord. You mean... Hmm... Keeping an eye. So is that why she jumped the So is that why she jumped the Overlord? Because... Him and Ichigo are one and the same, just opposites. So by default, since Ichigo's hot... Why Ichigo's hot in our mind? That makes sense. They never, have, they never actually met in the manga or the anime. She's never seen Ichigo's dark side. Well, yeah, she's never seen her his hollow. If only I knew. 
Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, I thought that was ready. There go. What? Another one? And it, it, there it is. It always does that before. There we go. And I wonder what the Overlord wants to get out of it. All this. What's his purpose? That's something you gotta have to ask him in person. Although maybe Miss Suifon might know a thing or two. There's nothing I wish to speak to you about. Yeah, because she, <laughs> she's still her favorite person in the world. <laughs> eh, I would say they're banging, but, you know, they never go into that kind of content. But, yeah. They're romantically interested. They just don't show it. Anyway, between Kisuke and Luigi, he says... I knew you'd be coming along with us. Having you as re a, as reinsurance is a big help. Shut your mouth. I am simply attending to Lady Yoroichi wherever she goes. Oh, here she goes. Is that smirk? If you if I see you doing anything in the slightest bit questionable, I will take you down. Please, don't scare me like that. I promise I won't do anything. I guess your relationship is pretty much the same no matter which world you're in. <laughs> I'll be right back. Ah, here we go. Byakuya. Uh, I wonder how the story's the same over here because Yoruichi was always teasing Byakuya when he was little. He was, she was pretty much a uh, another teacher for him for his martial arts and all that. Combat training. So let's see their relationship in this world. See if it's any different. <clears throat> now, where will I find him? Hmm. Aha! Yoroichi. Oh, wait, he says, in uh, conf uh, confused. Yoroichi? Where are you going? Long time no see, Byakuya, my boy. You... I do respect that the Lord himself seeks to stand guard in order to protect his own people, but you're way too tense. You'll lose sight in a critical moment if, you, if you're always like this. I'm sure I told you before. Looks like you still need more training. You still need more training. Such precious words from the Grand Knight. The guardian of Her Majesty's castle, I won't ignore. However, you just turned your blade on me without any warning. It appears to me you have a death wish. Nice shot. Taking the last hit for an assist computer character. Uh, hey, is he? That man is Byakuya Kuchiki, the lord of the Kuchiki clan, who has ruled over these parts for centuries. He is a very strong man and is the leader of a band of watchmen who are known to be quite skilled as well. We came here to request their aid in our battle. So let me guess... Since he's there, Rukia and Renji are there, and that's just the sum of names. Oh, wait till next year. <laughs> if there is, for this storyline. Then why is he fighting against Yoruichi? Those two have known each other over a very long time. Thought so. But Yoruichi may have been a little too playful with Byakuya when he was a child. It's exactly the same! <laughs> <laughs> so whenever they see each other, they always end up in a little fight. It's a bit troublesome, really. If you knew this was going to happen, then you should have known to stop them. Oh, are you? Are they not like this in your world? I've never actually seen it, but maybe they are. Oh, we never did! <laughs> okay. Okay, so I don't know how long this video is going to last. I'll try my best 
because I don't know how much storage space I got. Uh, you know what? Just to be on the safe side, I'll stop this video and I'll continue on with chapter five as part two. So this would be part one. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do this in parts because my storage space, because I see if those summons. That's 35 marks. So if you like this video, ladies and gentlemen, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Hit that subscribe button. You like the content and hit that notification bell for the next edition of Bleach Brave Souls featuring part two of the Coco Society Infinite. Peace out.